Welcome back to the English class. Today we are going to start with our literature portions and our first chapter in the literature is the best Christmas present in the world. Today we are going to read the first comprehension of the story. This story is about a stranger who finds a letter in a table which was destroyed in an incident and the letter belongs to a lady and which was written by the husband at the last or you can say jab unki death hone wali thi at the last of the time so here we starts with this thing before you read there are some dates of period of time in the history of the world that are so significant that everyone knows and remembers them the story you will read mentions one such date and event a war between the british and the germans so this is a story related to the british and the germans In 1914, there was a war going on at the border. Can you guess which war it was? Yes, yeah. you can find it out because this is the First World War. Now there are a few dates which are given here. You can find these answers on the page number 23. But the 4th of July 1776 was the American Declaration Day of Independence. Now, as we move on with the further story.
last bone was stuck and it was not coming out from the root of death. So, in N, I used brute force. Brute force means strong force. I struck it sharply with the side of my fist. Means you are putting your arms there to pull it off. Then, and the drawer flew open to reveal a shallow space underneath. Means when you pulled out the glass drawer, under that drawer there was a secret thing, a secret drawer. Now, there was something in there. I reached it and took out a small black tin box. What was there in the drawer, the last drawer? It was stuck. Yes, there was a small black tin box. Now, cello tape to the top of it was a piece of lined note paper. What was there in that secret box? There was a lined paper which was in cello tape. In cello tape, I it. And written on it in a shaky handwriting. You know, when do we have a shaky handwriting? Yes, the shaky handwriting is mostly the older age people have that thing because of the age. The small children also write in the shaky handwriting. Now, James' last letter received January 25th, 1950. What was written on that shaky handwriting on that letter? That James' last letter received on January 25th, 1950. To be buried with me when the time comes. Now, there was also written that this letter should be buried with the Pusisa Jaraja when he, when she dies there. I know, as I did, it was I knew, as I did, it, that it was wrong of me to open the box, but curiosity got the better of my clubs. It usually does. Now, curiosity means when we have something excitement for which we wanted to know. But here, because that letter belongs to somebody else, the stranger was so curious to open it and he thought that it was very, very wrong of him to open the anybody else letter to read it. Inside the box, there was an envelope. The address read there, this is Jim McPherson, 12 Copper Beaches, Bridport, Dorset. I took out the letter and unfolded it. Means he took out the letter, opened the letter and was started reading. It was written in a pencil and dated at the top December 26, 1914. Okay student, I hope the first comprehension is clear to you. We will be sending you the comprehension question answers in our PDF form. Plus the highlighted words which are there with the meanings and 